So if, if you get to somewhere with your strength where you're somewhat happy, I mean, you always want to get stronger, but let's say that you want to focus on endurance. What are you doing to maintain? Are you just, are you putting, doing strength wads, or are you, do you still have a strength specific program? I don't follow a program. I've never followed a program. I've never followed a strength program. I lift heavy things all the time. Okay? And that's that low tech, man. Pick up heavy stuff and put it over your head and do it all the time. Okay? Whether you're training endurance, whether you're training, you know, ultra sports, I don't care what it is. Pick up heavy things all the time and you're going to get strong. Right? It just, it, for me, like yesterday in that workout, I could have taken a, I did a workout afterwards with uh, my hybrid guys. And, uh, Oh, it's right up there. So one legless rope climb, two back squats, and three one-timers. Okay, with the stone up to the shoulder for five rounds. I could have chosen 315, but I hadn't squatted in a week, so I went 405. I mean, to me, so that was a good, that's 10 reps at 405. That's a good strength day. But there was also a good portion of Metcon in there. Yeah. Will you do like strongman type lifts seven days a week or six or however many days you're lifting? How often do you do muscle ups on the rings? Okay, so that, that's the answer, right? The question is how often do you do strongman movements? As often as you do anything else. It's another modality, right? It's one more thing. How often do you do push ups or pull ups or stones or the yoke or any other thing? How often do you row? It's one more tool. It's one more thing that you can just say, oh, instead of doing deadlifts with the uh, bar today, I'm going to do it with the axle. I'll do a double overhand grip deadlift on the axle because that's hard. So it, to me, it's just like add things to your, your arsenal. I don't think there's a right or wrong on that. What else? Yeah. What's your goat? Go? Yeah. Overhead squat. I hate it. I hate it. And I hate it because I suck at it. Yep. Overhead squat. My coach is trying to help me with it. <laughs> I think it's a question of uh, shoulder flexibility, which is bad. What else? No. It's okay. Do you use fish oils on a daily basis? No. The only supplement I take is a post water recovery. I don't take anything else. Yeah. Rob said earlier that um, you didn't necessarily get sore after a workout. Um, is that due to your diet and the frequency that you work out, or is that genetics? Um, I mean, I get sore, but I never get sore to the point where I can't work out. And when I, as over the course of the last month, workouts were leaving me broken, like a mess, shaking, puking, and that's you know I was. Up until two weeks ago, I was having conversations with my, my crew and, and my wife especially, like, do I really need to compete this year? And, and my head was just in the wrong place because my workouts were so bad. And not my, my scores were okay, but the aftermath was devastating. So it, rather than being able to do a workout at 11, and then if I wanted to do another one at 3, I was a mess. Mess. So I think my, my level of soreness is the only thing that I changed is my supplementation. The only thing. The workouts are the same, the intensity is the same. My workload might be a little higher because we've been out here pushing this thing, um, but everything else is constant. My sleep is the same. The only thing that changed is my supplementation. Yeah? How does that uh, California road trip compare to your normal training and uh, yeah, how did it compare? How did it compare? Uh, that California road trip, which was Sevon's idea, by the way, <laughs> um, was, I think, so far the best experience. That and the Tahoe Throwdown, so far, right? That's for me. That's that was kind of the top. Um, the the workouts were hard, harder than usual, because you're dropping in on somebody's box. They've got something cooked up. We let them pick the workout. So you're dropping in on their box, they're fresh, you're destroyed. We, were, we would do a, our second workout of the day around lunchtime, get in the car, drive four hours, jump out of the car and walk. It was brutal, brutal. 
It was um, right up there with as difficult as the games, but more fun. More fun. It was challenging. Good though.